here with my buddy Bobby Tyler of Tyler Gun Works in Freona, Texas. And this is a really cool project that he's got going right now. A very limited edition 1911 pistol. And I want to get Bobby to tell you a little bit about it. Okay, so we uh, are in cattle country. Right. And so around here, uh, you start talking about a cattle brand or... We was driving over here, man. Every town and every little thing is named after cattle. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Everything's cattle. Welcome to the beef cattle capital of the world. God bless them. I don't know yeah. what I do yeah. with that. Well, <laughs> you sure know when you get around them. That's right. Um, you do. Yeah. So anyway, we decided to come out with, and it's not something, we didn't reinvent the wheel. Right. There's been cattle brand guns being done for years. Yep. We decided to bring out a limited production of 50. But the thing that we decided to do differently than anyone else is if you have a family brand or your granddad had a cattle brand and you want yours on it, I'll put your brand on it. That's really cool. So you don't have to have a, a big cattle ranch. Right. If you found out, well, my granddad had a, had a brand. He lived out in so-and-so yeah. and he ran, you know, a hundred cows and his cows had a brand on them and this is my that's, brand. That's really cool. That link, that gun in uniquely to you and your your farm, your family, right. your heritage in a 1911 pistol, man, that's cool. It is. But the good news is you don't have to have a cattle ranch. You don't even have to have a brand. You don't have to be rich enough to get a cattle no, ranch. No, if you want to be a part of this heritage, yep. and this is how the West was won. That's right. You know, this and the 4440. Yep. But anyway, uh, if you want to be a part of this heritage, we have one that has a lot of the big cattle brands from around the United States right. that are iconic and they're pieced together properly. And what, we didn't want to do the cartoon character looking deal. Right. And so we have scroll engraving and, and it, it's yeah. all hand engraved. It's classier looking than most of the cattle brand guns I've seen. It's never really been my cup of tea, but it's got enough scroll in it to be really classy looking. So Ricky Sharp. Yep. was the engraver on this project yeah, he great job. and he hand engraved each one of these drew the patterns when I called him and said hey we got to change this I need to I need you to go ahead and add the this gentleman or this woman's brand or yep. this lady's grandpa's brand in it he sits down hand draws it in and it's it's exquisite tell me about the pistols what are they built on so they're a Colt a series Colt 7 Colt pistols. Good deal. and what we do is we strip all the parts out we replace them all with uh, carbon steel yeah. and we high polish them with neither of the parts after they come back from the engraver all the frames and slides are hard chromed okay. so that, that's how we get this lust yeah. beautiful bright bulletproof finish that's really cool dude. so a lot of these may be displayed open right for display and that's why I wanted that next level uh -huh. of finish so that you didn't have UV or the Sun distorting right. taken away because this is not just another 1911. This will be a generational Yeah, that's era. right. That's right. And it's a good working pistol. Built it on the coat. You know, you built it right. Got everything tweaked out on it. If you wanted to shoot it, you could shoot it. I would. Yeah, you know, oh, absolutely. They're made to be shot. But it's, it's just really a, a, a heirloom that your grandkids won't be able to tear up. Right. And it'll, be, it'll carry the family history on down with them. So when I was growing up and I'd ask my dad, you know about buying a pistol or this yeah. or that and he said son if it don't have a little colt pony on it yeah you probably right. shouldn't buy it yeah and uh, over the years i've thought about that because if, if we've all watched values yeah. of firearms go up yeah and when people are calling and saying well should i add some guns to our portfolio or how should i invest that always pops in the back of my mind because i've watched them Yep. over the last 30 years. Yeah, I've had people that ask me if they should invest in gold or whatever. I tell them, invest in steel. Yeah, <laughs> right. Yeah, well, this is a, a project that we did 50 of, and they're literally flying off the shelf. Oh, well. I, I wanted to show this to you, well, talk about it with you, I'm and glad, share. I'm glad to do it. So, when, when will they be about it? They, well, basically, we're selling these. Most of our projects, you get on our website and you buy one. You pre sell them, yeah. We are pre selling these because that gives the customer the ability to put well, their brand on it. Brand on it, got to. Right. Yeah. And so I, I'm trying to keep a few of these finished. Like right now, I literally have eight of these being completed that were just dot and I's and cross and T's. Right. And we'll have these ready to ship. And so if somebody wants one of these, we'll be getting some ready. But and for those, the, and those will be the one that won't have a custom brand. Correct, correct. But if, but if you don't have ranching in your family or whatever, 
but you want to have one of these with the iconic brands of history, there it is, yes. available, available now. Yeah, absolutely. If somebody wanted to get into one of these, Bobby, it would be would it be the same price if they wanted their custom brand as if they bought one off shelf? Absolutely. There's yes. no upcharge. Okay. There's no upcharge for the uh, handmade wooden box. Okay. Uh, the, really the, custom, box. the custom spur route. Right. Inside the box, right. it's all part of it. the custom spur routes color case, but they're all the same price because we're here to meet the consumer's needs. Right. That, that's a bargain for something like this. It's going to be passed down to generations, and it'd be a piece of functional artwork. Well, this is a Tyler Gunworks um, signature piece. Yep. Uh, it has our name on the box, yep. and so we care enough about it, we're giving it all we've got. And, and if somebody has ranching in their family, or they're interested in the American West, or ranching in general, they like 1911s, this is the pistol for them. Absolutely. Well, thank, thank you for thank coming you by. Glad to be share this project with you. Yeah, I am too. And we'll see what's next. Yes, sir, thanks. Thank you. Bobby, you ever seen a grown man naked? <laughs>